spiders all around you, but I see them all around me. Oh, hi, Mr. Number. How you doing there? Anyways, I just love numbers. Pretty much every day, everywhere, we're using them. Because I think it's very important to master them. Hello, friend. This is Yabi. As I promised in my last video, in this video, we will be starting our first chapter, Knowing Our Numbers for Mathematics from the book NCRT and this will be for class 6. Before I start my video, I just want to tell you, before seeing this video, you should check out my previous video known as odd numbers, even numbers, prime numbers and composite numbers and much more. You can find their link up right in the card or down in the description box. Coming back, today is our introduction lesson. So let's start. So let's start with the chapter guide. So our agenda for today will be introduction, comparing numbers, large number in practice, using brackets, and Roman numerals. Introduction. This is our first chapter, knowing our numbers. In this chapter, we will learn about numbers and how to compare them. We will practice large numbers, how to work with them, how to write them in words, and how to compare them even much more. We will also learn about brackets such as how many kind of brackets are there and how will we arrange them with numbers. Then finally we will talk about Roman numerals. In our previous classes you would have learned many of these concepts already. But even if you have not, don't worry guys, um, we will take each of the section in detail for our better understanding. Comparing numbers. In comparing numbers, we will learn how to compare and put the numbers in ascending and descending order. I'm sure many of you know what is ascending and descending order, but if you don't, ascending order means from the smallest to the largest, and descending order means from putting the largest to the smallest. We will learn how to form the greatest and the smallest number. We will also learn how to write numbers in words both in Indian and international system. Then we will see how to expand the numbers. Large numbers in practice. In this section we will learn con conversion from smaller unit to bigger and vice versa. For example, centimeter into meter, meter to centimeter, meter to kilometer and kilometer to meter, so on. Addition, subtraction, multiplication and division. So these are the four very basic principles of math. And to spice things up a little, we will use some word problem in this. Then comes a very interesting topic called estimation. Estimation means to give an idea of the quantity. For example, 410 can be rounded off to 400 and 670 can be rounded off to 700. Because if we round 410 to 500, it doesn't make sense because 500 is like really far from 400 and same is with 670. If we round it off to 600, it would be better if we round it off to 700 because 700 is closer to 670 than the 600. Using bracket. So this is personally my favorite. And if you like brackets, do tell me in the comments down below. The simple way to understand bracket is both mass. So both mass means B for bracket, O for operations, or you could say multiplication. Then D for division, multiplication, addition, and subtraction but you might be confused here like there are two multiplication so which one should be used first if in the sum it is given like off anywhere it is written off so you need to do the off before multiplication and if there is a multiplication sign and a division sign this doesn't mean you will do multiplication first because it's also known as off first you will do division if it is written off in the sum, then you will do multiplication first. Roman numeral. 
In here we will learn how to write in Roman numerals. So this is how we write one, two, and I'll show you how to write three. Something like one, two, and three. So that's how we write three. And I'm sure gonna show you how we write five. This is how we write five, and this is how we write four. And if you move the uh, st uh, the line to the right side of V, it becomes six. And if you add another one, it becomes seven. One more, eight. But nine, we write in a different form. We put X. X means ten. Here it is. And then we put a one there. So this means nine. So I'll just draw it clearly. Yeah, and that's it. So 50, we write it as L. Then 100 comes out as C. 500 D. And 1000 M. So that's a quick introduction and um, I'm gonna detail every section out in my coming up videos. I just want to say one thing before I close my video. Stay home in this corona pandemic guys. It can be really harmful for all of us and we can also lose our loved one. So I would suggest if you have a really really important work to do then go out not for any other reason. Anyways stay home Stay safe and to get better in that, do like and subscribe on my channel and even share this video so everyone can have some brainy knowledge. Till the line, bye!